what is going on to you capricorns so you capricorns oh before i begin there's a link in the comment section below called the link tree link click on it it will redirect you to a website which have all the ways for you to financially support the channel so i can most definitely keep the show going really appreciate it if you did so thank you in advance so for you capricorns you have the king of swords the queen of swords and the page of cups hmm, that's interesting so there's a sense of you capricorns definitely wanting someone okay so a lot of you capricorns are being way more straightforward in the fact that you you want to be with somebody you want to but the situation for you is you want to make sure that the person that you're with is not on some nonsense and wasting time and dysfunctional is the is the point right you want to make sure that they're not delusional or and there's a level of there's a level of of self-doubt that's that's with a lot of you capricorns around now in the sense that the way that y'all are looking at it y'all are looking at it from a perspective of with the queen of swords here that so many people are on some nonsense it looked like everybody is doing it but that's not true though that's not really a true thing what it is 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 that you capricorns have to take your time and get to know other people right um, and one of the fastest ways to get to know multiple people at once is to date, is to play the field, you know, excuse me, is to play the field. That's how it is that you get to know, uh, multiple people at once. But like it is, I said before, you're not smashing, you're not having romantic fun. You're not, you're not doing that. You're not getting any, not doing that. You're dating them, right? You're getting to know them so that you can get to know multiple people at one time and that's what's so important with it because the three of cups now and the hermit is all about how since that's the case a lot of you um a lot of you uh uh capricorns excuse me three of cups and the hermit is about how you're looking for something that you're starting to think that you'll never be able to get and like it is i said before that's not the truth what it is 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 that as of right now capricorn worry about yourself you know straight up worry about yourself because don't be don't be self-centered and conceited but most definitely worry about yourself and the reason why is i can even say something like that in the first place is because you capricorns your mind and your heart are in the correct place you worry about everybody else in the world like i said the last capricorn video except for yourself you put everybody's needs in front of yours you do all this selflessness you do all this charity work you do all of this type of stuff right and that's what aquarius represents aquarius represents charity work but capricorn and aquarius both share the same planet and saturn so you still have to give back and sacrifice and you know sacrifice the things that you may want at this moment and because of that fact, it makes you Capricorns into late bloomers. But the point that I'm trying to make here with that is you're a late bloomer. You're going to take a little bit of time for you to actually get to the, the, the to things and the people that you Capricorns want. That's just that's just Saturn. You know what I mean? That's just Saturn pumping to pump, uh, pumping, excuse me, the brakes. And but at the end of the day. It all comes down to timing because while other people, they, they, they get theirs first and then things are starting to slow down for them. Now you Capricorns are just getting started. Now it's like, oh, oh same thing when it comes to love. Four of Swords, Ace of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Right? A lot of you Capricorns are just now I ain't gonna say just now, but a lot of you Capricorns are starting to get started in the way that you're, you may have taken a little bit of time for you before you Capricorns started to really take dating uh, seriously. Or maybe even you, you, put, you pumped the brakes on dating for a while in your 20s so that you Capricorns can actually focus on your business and your finances and your health. You know, maybe you try to get to know other people and for whatever reason, in your 20s or in your teens it didn't necessarily work out for you so as a result of things not 
necessarily working out in the, in the matters of love. A lot of you Capricorns is like, okay, it is, you know, it is what it is. You're going to focus on you, right? And why that's an important thing in the first place is because the four swords represents putting something to sleep, putting something, to, giving giving an end to something, right? And the, and the end that is coming, the end that represents this free, this of uh, four swords that is happening for you Capricorns is the end of the Ace of Wands and the Queen of Wands, meaning that it's the end of dysfunctional, disrespectful relationships that you would have with other people. If a person is going to be around you and all it is that they're going to do is gripe and bellyache and be upset over the fact that you you are who you are and they're with you and all they do is complain and obligate you you capricorns are like this three of wands you don't have to put up with them and you will dump them and the three of swords is ironic because it represents the stupidity of it the, the of it all of them because the three of wands and the three of swords in, in this reading represents you will dump them and they'll look stupid <laughs> because they would have tried to they would have tried to obligate you capricorns so much and you cap they didn't know that you capricorns understand your own self-worth and that you know when you take care of yourself it's not about self-conceit or self-centeredness there's a level of you you have compassion towards other people and all of that and you're still willing to give you know that hasn't subsided but you realize when and where is a good time for you to give because you can give so much to the point where people don't respect you you know but then when you give to a certain extent and you give and all of that but you also leave a little bit back for yourself that's only fair you know you you're alive you know you don't have to ask to live your life and to enjoy yourself you don't have to ask other people or get permission in order to do that and a lot of you this is new york and a lot of you <laughs> capricorns are beginning to really understand that and and you'll be gosh darned <laughs> you'll all these all these corny terms you'll you know you'll be gosh darned <laughs> to to from now on that somebody will will obligate you and put you up to all of this and charge you up and they're so upset and they want this and you stick around there no you're gonna leave them high and dry so let's clarify some of these cards let's clarify the three of wands You have the uh, Six of Wands, the Hierophant, the Knight of Wands, the Four of Swords, and you have the Five of Swords to clarify the Three of Wands. So yet again, the Six of Wands and the Hierophant is about how, because for you, you're listening to yourself and you're listening to what you need. You're not getting so bent out of shape about what other people need so much. You'll do your best. You will be reliable. You're still the same person at the end of the day. You Capricorns are still focused on trying to be as good in a relationship and, and you'll still have love for the person, but at the same time, you're not going to allow someone to stress you out and make you lowered than what's, than make you, than make you feel low. It's about you Capricorns having to still like the relationship that you're in. Otherwise, it's not going to work out anyway. So the Knight of Wands and the uh, the uh, Four of Swords is about how, since that's the case, a lot of you, um, a lot of you, Capricorns have to really understand that what you've got going on is once again, people are still going to come at you like this, but obviously that's not everybody. You understand what I'm saying? That will only apply to the people who this applies to, who comes to you like that. But they'll learn very quickly that you're not putting up with that. And the Four of Swords, right? And the Five of Swords represents, they will change their tune very soon. That rhymed. But they'll change their tune very quickly, right? Very soon because of the fact that you Capricorns aren't putting up with this. 
you know, and if they and they have to respect it and stop doing the nonsense. Because even if, if they decide, okay, they're going to continue to do it, you Capricorns will dump them. So I just see a lot of you Capricorns right now. The things that you Capricorns need to do is if you're dating anybody right now, if you're getting to know anybody right now, you Capricorns need to seriously um, put your foot down and ultimately, you know, show why it is that other people should respect you. But that's pretty much it. Peace.